<laughs> Woo! Look at this, people. That is a beautiful jack right there. Hey everyone, welcome back. I've just got to let y'all know that in this video, it was so awesome. I have been waiting for the better part of one year to try and come out to the Jetty Rocks here in Freeport to try to get some revenge on a Jack Creval that just kept breaking me off. Not just one, probably seven of them. And in today's episode, oh my gosh, here we go. Just watch it. Hello everyone. Welcome back. Doing a little bit, doing things a little bit different today. Holy cow, those winds are blowing. Gosh darn, that wind is blowing. We're definitely gonna need this right here. Thank goodness I brought it. Last year I lost a lot of spoons and plenty of lures, all on the account of not having line that was big enough because of the Spanish mackerel's teeth. Uh, they would slice right through my leader. So I pre-made a couple of these right here. This is some titanium wire and this should definitely work. Tons of terminal tackle, just in case. Last time I used this fella and hooked into a jack, boy, he had his way with me. fighting that much so he's probably gonna be a little fella it is is that a smack oh yes that's a big old huge smack right there baby that is a keeper holy smokies so it pays off look at this beautiful Spanish mackerel really great eating right there Look at that, got him right here at the edge of the rocks, fooled the fella into biting. Boy, the smacks are out here, baby. They are out here. And I am not losing my hardware today. <laughs> Look at all the bait he is spitting out. He's like all these little tiny minnows. There we go. That dude is just gorging himself. Look at that. That's what they're going after. Now tell me that silver spoon isn't money. I could probably go down to one eighth ounce and probably just hook up with these fellas all day long. Oh, there's another solid hookup right there. Baby. Oh my gosh, we've got the pattern. That retrieve is golden. This fella. I don't want to lose my hardware. Oh yeah, this guy is, he's a keeper for sure. Good night. That is a keeper. Holy moly. Oh, we got him. Got this little sucker. <laughs> That's smack number six right there. Boy, these guys got some speed on them. They hit like little torpedoes. All right, what we're gonna do is go to the bigger spoon because this guy, this little half ounce spoon, I mean, he's getting it done every once in a while, but he's not getting the big ones, it seems. Here we go with the two ounce spoon. 
we're gonna see if we can hook into a jack or maybe the bigger sized mackerel There we are, we're on. We got him. Just like that, super far cast. So we got 30 pound braid and the 50 pound leader. A two ounce spoon, we launched it out there. And then now we've got this guy. Oh, I've been waiting a whole year to have another shot at landing one of these fellas. Oh, there he goes, he's gonna start walking the rocks. The good thing is, I don't have anybody over here on this side. Here we go, let's hope he's gonna turn. Get away from the rocks, buddy. Okay, I can feel the rocks. Oh, I felt it. I should have just walked over there with him. I got lazy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I know, I'm gonna have to chase him down next time. Oh, that's such a heartbreaker. All right, let's re-rig. Good to go. And a little bit bigger of a leader this time around. You know, just launch that fella out there. Oh, yeah. That is a nice... That's a smack right there. Let's see how big he is. I knew eventually if we throw the bigger variety spoon, we were going to catch the bigger variety Spanish mackerel. Look at this guy. He is a monster. That is some excellent eating right there. Oh, there we go. That is one. Yeah, baby. Listen to that. <laughs> I knew eventually we were going to have get another one. This was going to have to happen again. All right. This time we're going to follow the fella. I'm not going to get lazy and just stand stationary. I will chase you down the freaking jetty if I have to, bruh. Oh, for one right now. Let's see what we got. That initial run was amazing. I couldn't even stand up. All right, we're gonna start following this fella. Got lines out over here. Hopefully they're gonna be courteous and, and move them. All right, let me chase him down again. I'm gonna try to get him to turn. There he goes, there he goes, he's turning. All right, here we go. Uh, I'll, I'll bring him to you. I'll bring him to you, here he comes. All right. Just be careful. You got him? <laughs> All right, man. Woo! Man, you hooked up. I <laughs> Thanks a lot, brother. No problem. All right. Thanks a lot. No problem. Holy cow. Look at this beautiful but Oh, bro, you are so beautiful. First jack landed from the jetties and it is about time. Oh my gosh, look at that. Barely hooked too. Just want y'all to see how like close it was to coming off. Check that out right there. Barely hooked in the mouth. All right, appreciate it. Thanks so much. Got my buddy High helping me out with landing this beautiful jack. 
Let's hurry up and get him in that water. All right, Mr. Jack. It was a pleasure fighting you, buddy. There he goes. <laughs> yes, baby. After a year of waiting to hopefully catch one of these fellas, like not even catch, just hook into one and be so lucky to land that darn thing. Oh my gosh, what a fight. I'm telling y'all what, you gotta come down here to the coast to be able to experience something like that. It is just amazing to feel the power that those guys got. Fella just hit it like a darn dump truck. There we are, we got him. Well, this guy's got a little bit of muscle, but I'm telling you what, what I got on right now is a winch. Buddy, you going into the ice chest. Yeah, they, I just saw them blowing up over there in front of y'all. Only the big ones are hitting these. Big old spoons. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thanks for the water. There we are. Stuck this fella. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. We have a shot at another jack. <laughs> Holy cow, I've got the drag torqued down too. All right, we're gonna have to get up and start chasing this guy down. Let's get him to turn around, there we go. It doesn't matter. Whichever one's safer for you. All right, he's almost there to the surface. There he goes. All right, here we go, here we go. Yeah, he's a little bit bigger. Just be careful. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> oh, hi, thank you, bro. I got him. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Look at this, people. Oh that is a beautiful jack right there. He's a lot bigger than the one that I had just caught. And with this, I'm ending the video on a high note. Throwing a huge shout out to my boy Hi for landing this second massive jack right here. Beautiful fish. The jetties were on fire today. Buddy, I want to thank you for such a great fight. There he goes. So I hope you really enjoyed the video. Silver spoons were the ticket to everything being caught from the half ounce that I used to get all the uh, smaller size Spanish mackerel and then the two ouncer, that was the heavy hauler. That dude just wrecked the fish. Got redemption on those guys. All right, so that's gonna be it. I hope you all like really enjoyed the video if you did click that thumbs up button and i look forward to some more jetty action out here it was hot i had to leave them biting but i mean that's just the way it goes so i end on a high note thanks for watching until next time tight lines